Yeah, um... Hi. I'm sorry it's been a while, okay? I've... I've been busy. Okay, um... Couple of things. Yes, I know I'm a. I know that I'm behind on my uh, on my zero one vlogs. Um, I have been watching the show. It is really good so far. Um, like what? Well, only just got on episode twenty two this week, I believe. It's the episode debut of Metal Cluster Hopper. But yeah, uh, I know I'm behind with making videos on that. I. Again, I've been busy. Real world stuff is going in the way. Not to mention the holidays. Um, uh, the holidays only just passed, and I was immediately going back to work. Um, like within the first week of January, so been a wee bit busy, and um, and I know I also did originally say that um, the second part of my um, my figure I standard X Aid build video will be up soon. Yeah, they ain't happening now. I literally just deleted the video because, well, only three people ever watched that video, and I will freely admit it was shoddy, like really damn shoddy, and really the build video was just an experiment to see how well I would do. I think I did fine, but again, it was really shoddy, and only a few people watched it. So that's a project that that's not going to be touched upon again. Uh, what else has been happening? Oh, and I guess the one of the main reasons I um, I've not po posted anything in almost two months now. No, not almost two months. Entirely two months. Um, the Child Online Piracy Protection Act, I believe that's what it's called. Um, it's not to be a bit frightened, frankly. I mean, I had hoped my I hope my channel wouldn't be hit, and thankfully so far it hasn't. But because of the state of YouTube as it is right now, I don't really know if I if I'm really comfortable doing stuff on YouTube anymore. Like I only started coming back to YouTube when things started to st started to die down. You know, I started posting more videos, talking about movies and that. But frankly, again, with the state of YouTube and how it reacted to the Child Online Privacy Protection Act, or COPPA, if you will. Um, and, and, and don't don't and don't worry. You can still you can still leave a comment to the video down below. Um, like I, I set my channel as not for kids because the stuff I talk about. I mean, the stuff I talk about is technically for children, but but the way I talk about it isn't because that's how uh, that's how the FTC set up COPPA. Basically, we're specifying on whether or not your content is for kids or not for kids, they will still analyze it by a case-by-case -case basis. Like, say, um, if you're using snippets of a cartoon for parody or hu or um, or a bit more adult humor, then you ha and your channel is set to not made for kids, that will be fine. It's, it's basically... It's basically if you're promoting the wrong content, depending on how you have your channel listed. Like that, that's that's how they'll determine whether or not you're actually breaking FTC law. At least that's my understanding of it. I like the actual details behind Copa and what the FTC and you, how YouTube reacted to it. It's still very vague. Like even a couple months later, to, to the point where like um, like this guy I watch on YouTube, Runestone Reviews, um, he deleted all of his videos, just all of them, and he. Um, Migrate over to Vlare.tv and you know he's posting his videos back up back up on there. Um Frankly I don't know if I should do the same thing because again YouTube has gotten so there's this massive disconnect between YouTube and the people on YouTube. It's like but let me explain. There's a dis disconnect between the company YouTube and the content creators on YouTube. There's this sense that there's a sense that the company is blaming the people who got YouTube popular in the first place. So it really is frustrating for someone like me who's wanted to be doing, who wanted to do YouTube videos since he was a kid, and now that he is doing YouTube videos, it's at the worst possible time. I mean, I. 
That's not to say I'm going to delete all my old videos, although, to be fair, there are some that definitely could be deleted. Um, but it, it, is, it is a case where I'm not sure whether or not I want to keep these videos just on YouTube or, or to migrate over to another website. Um, like... The apparently daily 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 motion daily motion even if it is one of the better alternatives has been turning to crap recently. Um, I'm not sure if these will really work on Vimeo because because there's apparently a, a data cap limit, uh, a really outdated one at that. Um, uh, you know you know I know like one of the alternatives is you just publish on Pornhub, which no. Um, and you know, I haven't really been trying Flare TV, but apparently, but apparently it does well. It does well enough as it's just a video publishing platform, not not as like a legitimate business. I'm not entirely sure, um, and I don't really know if it's possible to just upload these kinds of videos straight to Blogspot. And even then, um, I would have. I don't think I really. Oh, no one. Actually, as far as I know, no one actually gets paid for doing stuff on Blogspot. I mean, I mean, I still got my blogs, but open. Plug is in the description below. Um, but it's 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 a really complicated situation. And okay, okay, here's the thing: I do plan to keep on making videos in the future, um, especially with the content I'm planning to talk about. Uh, for example, with uh, where did I where did I put it? Shit, should have had it on hand. Um, but yeah, basically, I. Uh, one of the videos I'm planning to make, at least by tomorrow, is my review of Birds of Prey, uh, aka the fantabulous emancipation of one Harley Quinn. Although, let's be honest, it should just be called Harley Quinn the movie, co-starring the Birds of Prey. But, that's beside the point, I'm not going to get into my thoughts on it right now, but I do have, I actually did something for the first time, like, for the first time ever going to the cinema, I actually took a little notebook, notebook and, you know, wrote down my notes as I went along. Um, it is a small notebook and it's only about four pages worth of notes, but I think that is, I think that's enough to really, um, like, constitute a good 15 to 20 minute video. And, yeah, I do plan on publishing the, like, making the video soon. I can't do it today because, well, I'll need to get this uploaded and I've got to go to work soon. Um, But again, okay, again, okay, just because of the uh, because of the state of YouTube as it is right now, and um, and how a lot of content creators are getting screwed over because of how because of YouTube's unfair algorithms and how it reacted to Copa or Copa, whatever one. It's challenging. It's just going to be legit challenging. Oh, and uh, I just remembered another one of the reasons we, we, why I haven't been publishing videos lately. We have a cat. So it, look, so it looks like the disease of so many other content creators has finally hit me because I now have a pet cat just like... Just like... Um, just, actually, there are quite a few content creators I watch. Uh, Engo, Engo has his own cats, I believe. Uh, Blake Carr has his own cats. Uh, Dominic Smith has his own cats. So, uh, you know, uh, Crimson Rogue has his own cat. I I'm pretty sure um, Strange Aeons Strange has a cat. I'm not sure. I, I did a plot to make this about a cat, okay? <laughs> but it is... It has been... It has been taking up a bit more of my time helping to look after this cat. Um... I really should have written down notes, like more specific notes for this video, but I can't really think of anything else off the top of my head. Um, I will be trying to get back to doing zero one vlogs because the latest episode has just come out, and maybe I'll just try to do like a catch up video, like give, give my overall thoughts on the show thus far. Um, I am certainly gonna try it, like the Birds of Prey video. I'm definitely, I'm definitely gonna try and film that tomorrow, depending on what time I get up. Um, and I've noticed that I've already done two videos of me playing Undertale. I might get back to doing that, but then again, we also got Doom Eternal coming out next month. Already got my pre-order in, so I'm excited. Um, 
So I might end up doing a video series on that. Who knows? It all depends if I have the time and if I'm still in a, in a job at that point. Um. Yeah, that's basically what I have to talk about. So, again, I'm really sorry for this for this um, unintended hiatus I took for a while, but it was to kind of just recharge my batteries and consider how uh, consider how to work with this platform. Uh, here's hoping this video doesn't get taken down just because I mentioned Pornhub. Um, and, you know, talked about talking about Copa, talk about Copa and the you know, made for kids, not made for kids thing, but. That's it, guys. I really appreciate any support you're able, able to give. You know, like this video, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel if you want to, ring that bell for notifications. Uh, follow me on Twitter. I'm at MediaHood23. And, you know, check out my blog spot. I'll leave the link to both in the description below. And, uh, yeah, that's it. See you guys later.